One of the world's largest rodents, the capybara, lives in the Pantanal wetlands in Brazil. The capybara is a semi-aquatic mammal and a unique species in South America. Capybaras can grow up to 1.3 meters in length and weigh up to 66 kilograms. These adorable animals are usually active in grassy areas near the water, and their main diet consists of plants such as reeds, grass, and leaves. In a typical capybara family, there are usually four to six adult individuals and some juveniles. They typically live in family units, where family members take care of each other, protect each other, and cooperate in maintaining their territory and resources. Capybaras are gentle in nature and rarely engage in conflicts with each other or other species. In the Pantanal, Brazil, we often see capybaras grazing on the grasslands in front of campsites along with horses. One of the most unique features of capybaras is that their eyes, ears, and nostrils are all located on the top of their heads. They can even sleep underwater with their noses just above the water surface when necessary. Capybaras have small ears and keen sense of smell and hearing. Their hind feet are highly adapted with webbed toes, which help them swim in water. They are excellent swimmers and enjoy diving in water to search for food and escape from predators. Capybaras have several natural predators, including jaguars, caimans, and pythons, which may lurk in or near the water and ambush capybaras. Predation by these natural predators poses a threat to capybara populations. Due to their gentle nature, lack of agility, and slow movements, capybaras are considered vulnerable in the animal food chain. Although they can quickly escape by jumping into the water when faced with danger, they are still often hunted by predators and serve as an important food source for them. In the Pantanal wetlands of Brazil, capybaras play a crucial role as ecosystem engineers. They modify the water flow in their habitats by building dams and burrows, which helps maintain the ecological balance of rivers and lakes. 